The main goal of this video is to record what I've learned and maybe help others struggling to learn as well. The first window that we see after launching DaVinci Resolve is called the Project Manager window. To you, this window may appear a bit different. For instance, on this toggle button, we open the database pane. In this video, I'm not going to dive deep into the local database pane. Just know that as long as you have the local database, it's enough to start your first new project. Here you have the option to backup the database, restore the database, different options to sort database by database name, by schema, by status, by location, ascending and or descending. The next button you see provides more information about the databases. You can also filter the database by database name, schema, status, or location. The first time that you launch DaVinci, it should appear the project called the title project. The slide button lets you minimize or maximize the view of the projects. You can preview the projects. In this case, it's an empty project, so you're not going to preview anything. And the video one is a project folder. This icon is the same as with the databases and lets you organize the view of the projects by name, date modified, timelines, format, and frame rate. This icon provides more information. It's colored if it's active. It's grayed out if it's not active. These two buttons make it possible to choose between icons and list. And the search field lets you filter by name, format, and notes. There are more than one way to create your first project. You can create your first project by double clicking Untitled Project. You have your first project open. Still not saved, but already open. By the way, if we want to go back to the Project Manager window, we can go to File. And here you can launch again Project Manager. You can also press Shift plus 1. Let's open this again. Another way to create a new project is to click Select the project and click Open on the right side corner. To create a new project folder like the folder video 1 present on this video, Click New Folder. Another way to open a project, in case this doesn't appear, is click New Project. Give a first name to your project. And create. Here we have our first project. If this video was helpful for you, please subscribe.